Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. I have a Bath and Body Works um, semi-annual sale haul <laughs> to share with you today. I did not purchase any candles. And to be honest, I really was not even going to participate at all um, in the SAS haul. I didn't feel that, um, well, I'm, I never need anything, I guess, but um, I think I was just like preoccupied with other things. So I wasn't really checking the site that often, but then I remembered I had a nice gift card <laughs> that I had tucked away and the friend that gave it to me said, I know how much you love shopping the SAS hauls, um, and that she hoped that I could pick up some good things. <laughs> so I remembered about that and picked these things up, ordered these things on Sunday, um, I have a store that's literally like two minutes from my house, a brand new store, but I felt like I would overspend if I went in store. So my good friend, Megan, always keeps me updated about the sales and when they've dropped prices even more on Bath and Body Works and all of that kind of stuff. So I looked around and figured, you know, why not? And I got a lot of stuff for a little money. And that some of the stuff, there's a reason behind why I purchased it and that kind of stuff. But anyway, let's just get into it. Um, like I said, I didn't get any candles. I did pick up a wallflower plug, um, which I thought was like really cute in this succulent planter plant, whatever you want to call it. And it's the one that has the scent control, which I don't have any of these. Um, so I had like the free reward for up to $16.95 and that's how much this was. Um, I think it looks nice from like a distance, like it'll be fine, like plugged in, but like up close or if you touch it, it's kind of cheap, but whatever. I'm hoping, um, that the scent control ones are really strong if I put it on high. So that was my freebie. And then, of course, it wouldn't be a haul if I didn't pick up soap. But I didn't go crazy. Um, that's probably... Yeah, I didn't pick up a lot of soap. So I went ahead and grabbed another garden basil and lime from the White Barn, which is fresh basil, zesty lime, and mandarin. Um, this is great in my kitchen if I don't want to use, like, the kitchen lemon one. I picked up two of the Radiant Sky in the Gentle Foaming, which is Rays of Sunshine, Golden Mango, and Juicy Lychee, which, yeah, it smells very mango-y and good and perfect for summer. So I have those. Um, citrus and Vetiver, love this. I don't think I've ever had this one before. I mean, who knows? It's sparkling lemon, sweet orange, and fresh vetiver. This smells so nice. Yeah, really, really good. I can't, I won't sniff everything, but that's a good, a good one. I know there's still some stuff on the site for sales. Um, bright summer days in the gentle, uh, the cleansing gel. It's coconut milk, sunny star fruit, and warm sands. I thought that the packaging with the little, like, Chase Lounge with the umbrella um, looked really cute. So that was it for soaps. And then I picked up a couple wallflowers. I did not go crazy. Because uh, I feel like I have quite a bit of summer ones. And I don't know if, like, with my air like the central air like blasting. I don't, I feel like the wallflowers, I'm not going through them. Maybe that's just in my head, but I feel like they're lasting a really long time. But I know they have a lot um, still on sale for like $1.98 or something. So I picked up a mahogany coconut, which is technically and typically not my cup of tea. It's creamy coconut, mahogany woods, and English lavender. Um, I was at a high school graduation <clears throat> party, gosh, back in May, and I was talking to a friend of mine um, there, and I was like, you smell so good, and she said, um, oh, do I? And her son said, no, that's me, and her son is 
the same age as one of my sons. And I said, what is that? And he said, it's the, the mahogany coconut um, spray from Bath and Body Works. And I was like, what? It just smelled so, so good. So I did pick up um, one of those and grabbed a white t-shirt, which I've had before. I really love this. I love it in the soap, in the body wash. Um, it's just a nice, clean, clean smell. It's crisp hair, lavender cloud, and soft sandalwood. Just clean, clean, and fresh. A warm ocean breeze. And it's in the warm and comforting category. Ocean sandalwood, warm sage, eucalyptus zest, and coconut. So we have that one. And then a indigo paradise in the fresh and relaxing category. It's exotic citrus, sugarcane, and black currant. So there's that. I'm gonna have to back this up. I grabbed one um, fine fragrance mist, which I don't typically buy these. Um, I have a couple that I really have liked and I've been able to, you know, make a dent in them. I love the, the Beach Nights one and I'm almost out of that. Um, so I definitely don't have a stockpile of the mists. I just don't, I don't know, I don't grab them. But this is Spun Sugar, Pink Berries, and Whipped Vanilla. And I sprayed this several times throughout the day yesterday just to see. Um... It's there, it is very pretty, but it does not last um, in the cotton candy clouds. So I grabbed that and I did get it, I think, in the I got it in the lotion, which you'll see, and also in the body wash. Um, so I picked up a pretty large amount of body washes only because <laughs> I'm gonna justify my purchasing in my closet in my master bathroom. I keep, you know, all like the different toiletries and stuff like that. And I've usually had a pretty good stockpile of body wash, not Bath and Body Works, but oh gosh, I don't, whatever my kids use and like Dove and um, I can't think of brand names like Zest and all the things and I'll buy them when they're on sale and then the boys just take them as they run out. Well, my back stock of that has been depleted. <laughs> So that is how I justified purchasing. And honestly, they don't care. Like in the summer and stuff, they'll use these fruity ones and stuff like that. They don't, you know, as long as it doesn't smell like roses, I think they're good. Um, so, and I only have, I think, two Bath and Body Works um, shower gels currently in my closet. I think I have a strawberry pound cake and like a Christmas cookie one or something. So... Anyway, I re you know, I stacked this back up. So I got the Gingham Vibrant. Um, I haven't tried anything from the Gingham, the Gingham line. So I don't even know what the scent notes are. And I don't want to open all of these. But again, they were just such a good deal that even like going into the store to buy body wash, I still made out better doing it this way. I did pick up two of the Waikiki Beach Coconut. Um, it has fragrance notes on this one. Tropical white coconut, saltwater breezes, and sun bleached woods, I believe that says. Yeah, so I grabbed two of those. Um, groovy watermelon. I did get two of those, which I like this, these, um, I don't know any what any of the lines, um, like when they come out with new releases and stuff, I don't know what any of them are called. So Groovy Watermelon is Juicy Pink Watermelon, Sugared Strawberry Blossoms, and Lime Zest. So it's like very 70s um, packaging. And a Rainbow Waves, which is Sunny Sangria, Bright Melon and Misty Waters. So one of those. And Disco Daydream. Which I, Cali, I think that says Cali Days. Oh my gosh. 
gosh, no. You guys, I don't, I can't read this. I'm sorry. Um, wild Vanilla and Radiant Coconut. Oh, wow. I don't know. Excuse my inability to see that tiny writing. But Disco Daydream. One of those. A Sunset Glow. Which has a cute lighthouse and like sailboats out on the water. And it just says Summer 23. Uh, fresh Coconut, Sparkling Cherry Seltzer, Dreamy Moonflower, and Caramelized Vanilla. That one sounds really good. Fruity Sherbet Scoop, which I was kind of unsure about this one. <laughs> Rainbow Sherbet, Zesty Orange, and Sun-Kissed Strawberry. No, that sounds good. Whoops. And... Oh, that's like the last body wash, but it's not. Um, whipped coconut milkshake. This is the one that I think I'm most excited about because I got this in the body cream and it smells amazing. It's vanilla ice cream, toasted coconut, and sugared amber. Um, yeah, I tried the body cream yesterday too and it's super nice. Um... Reminds me, well, I'm not even going to get into that. People can determine what they think it smells like. Um, okay, and a cotton candy cloud, which I did order two of these, but they left one out, so they're sending another one. Um, did I not? I told you guys what it was in the fragrance mist. Spun sugar, pink berries, and whipped vanilla. And Firecracker Pop, which is red cherry, fresh citrus, and juicy berry. So, I was kind of curious about this in the candle, but I think I have enough wax that kind of smells this way that I was okay not getting. I was determined not to, not to buy more candles. Um, oh, and another soap, which I don't know how I didn't see that. This soap is in, it's one of the blends, in watermelon, lemonade, and eucalyptus mint. And I was shocked at how nice this smells. I didn't know that would be a great combination, but it really is. So um, my kids really like the watermelon lemonade soap. So that's just a little extra in there. Okay, and then some um, body creams, body lotion. So I got pastel skies in the body lotion which it probably has sent notes. I can't see them, but pretty packaging there. I prefer the um, body cream over the body lotion, but that's okay. Pastel skies, can always hang on to these as little like added things to gifts. And then um, the sunset glow, because I did get that in a body wash. Um, and it does have shea butter and coconut oil. So... There's that super fun summery packaging. And then the um, body cream. Oh, I love this. Whipped coconut milkshake, just like the body wash. This smells so amazing. It seems to be long lasting. I put it on um, my arms and my legs like a couple hours before I went to bed and I could smell it. So um, these are my favorite. They don't feel like greasy on or like sticky. And I find that sometimes the actual like body um, lotion does. So I prefer these. Um, so I picked that one up and picked up one in the cotton candy clouds. So I have the mist, the body wash, and then the cream. I don't always have to be matchy matchy. Um, but yeah, sponge sugar, pink berries, whipped vanilla. So yeah. And I want to say when I bought this stuff, there, it wasn't like an additional 20% off or something crazy plus free shipping or yeah. So I don't know. I got a good deal for all of that. I know no candles and I'm okay with that. I'm going to get this stuff put away. I'm stocked up. Um, for body wash for a while so that makes me happy and picked up a few more soaps because 
they were there and why not? So that is everything you guys. Um, I hope you're all doing well. I'm going to stay off the Bath and Body Works site. Um, I don't need anything. I have room for this stuff, but um, we should be all set here in my house for quite some time. So I hope you are all doing well. And um, I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Take care.